three, two, one. Right now I'm checking the cameras to make sure they're set and that everything's ready to go. What makes the project so unique is that no one has ever given you an interactive experience from 100,000 feet. We believe these are some of the best images ever captured by a high altitude balloon project. And this is how we did it. We constructed a capsule using readily available materials and very simple techniques, even though we had access to a machine shop to expedite the process. It's an engineered aluminum frame. And the reason was is we need to have exact precision for those cameras to capture that image. In the overall scheme of the project, the construction process was quite short because our real emphasis was on testing. While the testing could have been done in our backyard, we simply wanted to take it to different places and to show some really unique spots. And that's why we had to walk a lot, drive a lot. We really tested the Earth360 capsule to the extreme. We put it through stitching tests, through water tests, dangled it over cliffs, from trees, everything imaginable to make sure that it would work on that day. After a restless night, it was really good to be ready to launch. Launch day was the culmination of nearly six months of work, so we were so anxious to just get this thing off the ground in the air. That moment of letting go was pretty scary just because I knew I had no longer had control over this project. All that engineering, all that testing now had to work. We built, we tested, we launched, we recovered. The results are awesome, but it's only the beginning.